In some of the world's most remote and dangerous regions, people are calling. People are waiting. They are at risk, but they are not forgotten. Their calls are heard. They can be reached. They have MAF. We are their link. We are reaching the world's most vulnerable people. Where it can take days to reach them by road through the most rugged terrain, MAF can fly it in hours. It is our mission to be there for them whenever and wherever we are needed. Our flying teams are ready to say yes. Ready to fly the extra mission, to give the extra time. This is about just one of those teams with a crucial mission ahead. We're at Nairobi, the hub of our operations in Africa. Flight schedules are planned, radio contact maintained. It's here that our fleet is meticulously maintained, serviced and prepared for flight. Nothing can be left to chance. For this assignment, MAF has four key people in the flight team. Two of them are based here in Nairobi. This is our operations coordinator with his ever-present clipboard. He's confirming flight readiness with our engineer. She knows that the people of Kimatong in war-ravaged Sudan are waiting. She understands the urgency all too well. Good morning. Could I have it now? I need to do that change right now. This is our pilot for the flight to Kimatong. His schedule is tight, but this is not routine airline flying. Not only must he be ready to fly when all is set fair, but also when it isn't. The airstrip looks fine. It's about 900 meters. It can take about 1160 kilos out. His experience on this and every mission is crucial. With him is the project manager of the medical relief agency who called for MAF's help. All last-minute details are checked with the team and the aircraft is prepared, loaded with its vital cargo and all set for takeoff. I've just had from maintenance that the aircraft is ready. The aircraft now is in ship ship. Oh, good. Yeah, it's in good condition. We tried to stay away from the mountains because that's LRA area. This particular mission is to speed urgent medical supplies into Kimatong. An outbreak of yellow fever is sweeping the region and could all too easily spread. This would prove fatal for the most vulnerable, particularly the young children. Every hour is crucial. All right, let's get going. There are no airfields where we are going, just primitive strips scraped out of the bush. There is no time to lose. The precious cargo of vaccine is required now if lives are to be saved. In some of the world's most remote regions, the only link is MAF. MAF exists for times such as these. Our flying teams must be the best professionals. It is their job to be there for the most vulnerable, for those in need, and for the organizations who serve and care for them. As Christians, of course, they do much more. They offer their hearts, their lives, and their prayers to the work. Lord, we are praying that as they fly today, Lord, that Father, you, your spirit may just be with them. Ahead of them, one mission among many in Sudan, one mission among over 200 undertaken by MAF this and every other day. Ahead of them, the people of Kimatong wait hopefully, praying that help is on the way. Behind them, the dedicated backing not only of our flying team, but also of our home churches and MAF supporters who share this mission with us. The landing strip at Kimatong is in view. Only hours have passed since our departure from Nairobi and within minutes, the vaccine is being unloaded. Our 
Our mission partners have gathered the people. We've reached them in time. Without delay, the yellow fever vaccinations begin. Degrees, and you look at the nipple, then you do it like that. And vitally, local people are taught how to administer the vaccine themselves. As the people of Kimatong wait their turn, news reaches us of a local man in urgent need of medical attention. He needs hospital treatment fast, but hospital is hundreds of miles away. Our pilot must respond immediately to this sudden emergency. He will because MAF teams are there to say yes, to fly the extra mile. My clima, my clima, Mastri. Mastri, my name is Mike Tabemba. Mastri request confirmation for green light. Your name is Anwal Deng, 26 years, male, strangulated hernia. Uh, confirm Mastri, we've got a uh, patient, a uh, med worker uh, from Kimatong. The name is uh, Anwal Deng and the male, strangled hernia. Uh, that's a firm. Flying the extra mile means going wherever people are hurting from sickness, poverty, war or natural disaster. Taking food to the hungry. Medicines and supplies to the sick. Care and Christian love to those in desperate need. We will not forget them in our hearts or in our prayers. Wherever vulnerable people are suffering, MAF will be there. With God's grace and your help, they can be reached. They are calling. They are waiting. They are at risk. We will be there. On the ground and in the air, this is Mission Aviation Fellowship. Back at base and in the field, in our hearts and in our prayers, with every mission we undertake, with every extra mile we fly, we are their link. This is truly flying for life. Please help us to be ready. If we can reach you, we can reach them. We can't do it without you. We can't say yes without you. We need you on our supporter team now.